My name is Lisa Allen. I work for the Bureau of Land Management National Aviation Office. I'm a lead plane pilot for them. We're in Boise, Idaho at the National Interagency Fire Center, also uh, on the grounds of Gowan Field, the, the Boise Airport. And what we're doing here today is our annual MAFS, uh, military uh, annual refresher for fi firefighting with our C-130s. The job of the lead plane pilot is to increase the uh, safety margin for all of the air tankers and the helicopters, if we're working with helicopters, that are uh, fighting fire. And we do that through um, flying a little bit more nimble aircraft, uh, being on scene all the time, we can see uh, the conditions changing. We find the lines, we search out all the hazards, we scout the exit routes, we coordinate the airspace. Uh, and so safety is our main goal. Our secondary becomes efficiency and effectiveness. We help the tankers get onto the line. We can coordinate the resources so that we're using them all efficiently and effectively. This, this annual tender is super important in that it enables the uh, existing air crews and the lead plane pilots to work together without being on a fire assignment in a training environment to knock off the rust, uh, get used to each other's cadence, the, the, the drop profiles, but it also enables the air crews to, for new air, air crews to come in and train and learn the mission before they actually go out and fight a wildland fire. Being able to work with the military during active uh, activations is super important, both to the BLM, the Forest Service, our state cooperators, and that they bring more resources to the table. Our main uh, purpose as aerial firefighters is to support the people on the ground, the men and women that have that are down on the ground digging line, using dozers, using engines, hotshot crews, smoke jumpers. We support them, and by having the military involved and available to us, we're better able to, to help them.